What's going on guys? Today is the last game of the regular season that I will be hosting heading into the playoffs this weekend. So hopefully you guys are ready for that. And in the last video, you guys have seen that my team is number one in the East. So we're getting ready for the playoff run. Hopefully we can do some damage. If not, it's fine. We had a great season. And today, like I said, is also day three of the challenge that I'm doing. 30 days in a row towards my B-Day birthday. So John Moran gets a dunk right there. So I think I could do it. Hopefully after this 30 day challenge it becomes something consistent and I don't have to challenge myself you know to do these videos every single day because like they say it only takes three weeks to build a habit I think 21 days and I'm gonna be doing this for 30 but I did it before I remember a few years ago I did 30 days in a row in the summer of NBA Live 15 ultimate team so I can do it definitely <laughs> So hopefully you guys are enjoying these daily uploads because I <laughs> I feel like it's super fun online leaks and I really enjoy uploading these gameplay for you. So Jason Tatum with a crazy three point shot deep right there. So my opponent is the Toronto Raptors. Obviously he has uh, Tatum and who else does he have on his team? I don't really remember. And my screen is super small so I can't really see too much. But I think he had um, he had John Morant, Tatum. He had Whiteside, he had, who else, Fred Van Fleet, Al Horford, and Ibaka. He had a lot of good players, so this was a very close game, especially in the first half. Not a lot of scoring because he has great defense as well, just like my last opponent, so it's very hard to score. So speaking of defensive possessions, this is one of them right here. We force him into a tough shot, and then we get the rebound. So again, this will be another great defensive possession. Nice strip right there. Four seconds left on the clock. He's going to end up shooting another tough shot. So that's what we like to see. Great defense. We just got to capitalize on the other end, which we do here. Paul George gets the nice layup. It's a seven-point game. Hopefully, we can extend it to a double-digit game. I have Paul George coming off a screen. He jumps a little bit late, and we get the dunk inside. Nice trip right there by Brogdon. <laughs> but I told you, Brogdon is such a beast. He has the wingspan. He has the height for a point guard. He kicks out on the corner. He makes a three. <laughs> by the way, at the moment, our league is currently full. I'm getting a lot of messages if it's still open. We do have a waiting list, actually. So if you do want to join, I'll add your name on the list. There's a couple of people waiting already. I think we have four people waiting. So if you want to join, we're going to be replacing teams um, whenever <laughs> whenever we have to. And by that, I mean if ever there's teams that quit the league or they become inactive or they want to be replaced or you never know. There could be so many different reasons. Then obviously we're going to invite you to the league. No worries about it. But right now it's currently full. But I'm still taking names for the list. So the earlier you message, the earlier you'll be able to get in. And this is also on the PlayStation 5 because a lot of people have been asking me if it's on Xbox, but it's on PlayStation 5. So maybe one day we'll be running Xbox, but it's a little bit too complicated to run on two different consoles and find people, especially that, that a lot of people don't even have a PS5 or Xbox yet. We're going to be waiting until everyone gets one and then when everybody does it's going to be much easier to make leagues but right now it's still an early league so <laughs> we're still doing some testing and everything but so far so good paul george with the spin move and the dunk right there so right now it's a 13 point game we do have a double digit lead right now he pulls up for three <laughs> i let him shoot that because that was quite deep and john moran his specialty is not three point shooting but if you made it, you just got to clap your hands and then <laughs> live with the result because I don't want John Moran getting in the paint or anyone is getting in the paint. I'd rather him <laughs> let them shoot. <laughs> so yeah, Isaac with a nice contest and that we're going to get a dunk right there. So we're still maintaining that double digit lead midway through the third quarter. I predicted him going baseline with John Moran. We get a nice bumping animation. I got lucky there because a lot of times the offensive player wins no matter what because 2K has more offensive animations. 
And Jonathan Isaac is creating havoc in this third quarter, playing great defense on Tatum. He gets the strip right there. He gets a tip pass. So this is why I drafted Isaac. I wanted to put the length against perimeter players. And he's going in the paint here. We're going to get a nice defensive stop again. So this third quarter, defensively, our whole squad stepped up. I don't know how many points he scored in this third, but... It was great defense by our whole team. Paul George in the paint. He jumped a little bit too early. We get the layup. So Paul George again is going to call for a screen right here. I go the opposite direction and he gets a nice dunk. So at this point of the game it's 15. He pulls up for a 3. He misses with Devontae Graham. We're going to try to take advantage because every time they miss a 3 point shot you have the opportunity to go on the break because it's a long rebound and your players are already leaking so it's much easier than when they miss a paint shot. So now he goes on a mini run to end the third. He breaks our double digit lead from 15 to eight. And he's gonna move the ball right here to Al Horford off the nice drive and kick and he gets a green release and it's only a six point lead. So to end this third quarter, I have Josh Okogie on Devontae Graham to get the defensive stop, hands up in his face. There we go. Heading into fourth, it's a close basketball game. Our 15 point lead, like I mentioned, was destroyed. So we gotta push it back up and prevent this comeback. Paul George in the lane. Nice drive, and he gets fouled. He's getting the paint. Fred Van Fleet off a screen. He gets a three point to go. So CP3 time. You know, when in the clutch, I give the ball to CP3. The Florida General, the Maestro, dictate the offense. Buddy Heald off his screen. He plays up a little too high because he thinks I'm going to shoot the three. So I decide to drive in the paint. Easy dunk. Like I said, you got to read. <laughs> oh my gosh, Whiteside missed the easy dunk right there. I don't know how Whiteside missed that, but that's Shaq in a full moment. So like I said earlier, you got to read the defense. And sorry if my fan is a little bit loud. My computer is, uh, is going crazy right now. So sorry about that. John Moran gets the dunk. So now it's only a six point game. John Moran gets another dunk. I'm telling you, when John Moran gets in the paint, it's unstoppable. He brings a double team. He ends up getting the jump ball right here. Late push. Jason Tatum pulls up for three. It's a miss. So he ends up fouling me. I only make one free throw, so he gets the rebound. He pushes it. Fred Van Flew back to back triples. It's back to a two point game. And after exchanging some threes and free throws, he has the opportunity to tie the game. <laughs> we get the steal to end the game. So we got lucky there because we missed a lot of free throws. He made some threes and he had the chance to tie the game and potentially go into overtime. But we get the nice steal at the end like you guys saw. So this is another closed game. This puts a wrap to our uh, regular season. Playoffs will be coming in this weekend. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Please drop a like and comment. It really does help out and I really do appreciate it. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video and want to get flashed, please be sure to share and like this video. To stay updated, click subscribe and also follow GFlash on Twitter.